Welcome, welcome back everybody to another video. Thanks for stopping by and tuning into another one. I truly appreciate it. So guys, today's video I'm so freaking excited for because we're jumping into the next episode of the Road to Blue Iron Man Challenge. Man, that's going to take some getting used to guys. But yeah, you guys, we're headed into episode number 18 of the challenge. Are you kidding me? That's absolutely insane. I know I say that literally every single episode of this challenge, but I've been having an absolute blast on this account and the progression that we've been having every single week has been really, really enjoyable. Now, before I get a little bit too far ahead of myself, I know we have a few new family members here watching the channel so I want to make sure that we're all caught to speed with the rules so nothing is confusing moving forward with the episode but before we do that I just got to say to all of you guys thank you so so much for all the love and support on this series it is by far one of my favorite things to come back to every single week I'm very very proud of this series and I know that we're inching very very closely towards the end of this series because we're very very close to completing it but don't worry you guys I have another series lined up for after this one so guys with that being said once again thank you guys so so much and let's run the rules here we go the Road to Blue Iron Man Challenge is a series where we try to make Brawl Stars as difficult as possible for ourselves so that we can become a better player because of it. There are two main rules to this challenge. One is we can't progress onto the next brawler via League Rewards or opening up Brawl Boxes until we get the current brawler that we're on to 340 trophies. The second main rule is that we have to keep this challenge difficult, so there's no leveling up our brawlers whatsoever. Our brawlers will stay level 1 for the entirety of this challenge. If any of these two rules are broken, we'll be forced to quit the account that we're currently on and make a brand new one, starting completely over. So yeah, guys, those are the rules of the challenge. Pretty dang simple. Only two basic rules that we have to follow. Now, we just recently had some modifications to the whole entire series where the ranks changed a little bit, where it once was called the Road to Purple Iron Man Challenge, but now we're calling it the Road to Blue. But yeah, you guys, also another thing that I want to bring up before we get into today's video is that another reason why I love this challenge so much is because I get to do it along with you guys. We have a pretty dang solid community revolving around this challenge where people are doing this along with me. All you have to do is create a brand new account uh, with Supercell ID. It's very, very easy. We have two main bands that you guys can join right now. They're called Purple Iron Man and Purple Iron Kid. So feel free to try it out for yourself. We would love to have you a part of the challenge as well. Now, taking a look at what we're going to be doing in today's video. So as you can see, we still have to get Pam to 340 trophies, which is the fun part of the challenge. We're sitting at 33 trophies, so we have a while to go. More than 300 trophies to get in today's video. So we'll see how long it actually takes. Now, taking a look at the Brawl Boxes that we're going to be opening once we complete Pam. We have 10 regular Brawl Boxes, one big Brawl Box, and we also have 229 gems left over from the last video that we did. Also, if we don't get a brawler from the brawl boxes that we open up in today's video, I'm willing to spend $20 worth of gems in today's video as well. And guys, I'm feeling very, very lucky. We still have two epics to get, and that's Frank as well as Piper. And then we have Mortis left to get, and then two legendaries. So that is Spike and Leon. So guys, we have five brawlers to get. Hopefully we can get something. Now, in the rare case, if we don't get any new brawler on the brawl boxes that we open, we'll just revert back to League Rewards, and the next brawler that that would be is Dynamite. So that's like the safe option if all goes wrong, basically. <laughs> So now that we have everything laid out for today's video, we're going to be heading into our grind with Pam. I'm really looking forward to Pam. She's really, really good in the meta, and I have high hopes for completing a relatively quick time with her. So guys, we're going to be checking in every single hour like we normally do on our challenges, so we'll see how we can do in the very first hour. Here we go. Alrighty guys, so coming up at a little bit past one hour, I lost track of time just a little bit, but guys, take a look at the trophies that we're at in one hour. 212 trophies. Pam is an absolute beast in Showdown at level one. She has really, really high DPS to rip through the boxes, as well as she has relatively high health. I love this brawler. Let's keep going. Here we go. Alrighty guys, so we're just a little bit under two hours and we just ended up taking fourth place. So that's another three trophies and take a look at the progress that we have with Pam after two hours. We're at 279 trophies guys. Pam is shaping up to be probably one of my favorite level one brawlers that we had so far in the challenge. So guys, loving Pam right now. Let's continue this push. Here we go. Okay, guys, so 30 minutes later, and we're already there with Pam. Two hours and 30 minutes? Are you kidding me? Pam was so incredibly fun. Such a delight. I really, really enjoyed Pam for this challenge. Now, guys, it's time to get these last three trophies and clinch that 340 trophy spot. Here we go. But, and I've been forgetting to do this as of recently, but take a look at the trophy drop. Here we go. 101 trophies. Oh, baby, I love that. Okay, guys, let's get into it. Here we go. Alrighty guys, moment of truth, it's time for the final match with Pam to get her 340 trophies. I'm so freaking pumped up. And as you can see, we're only two trophies away now because I tried to get a little bit closer and I know I shouldn't be flirting with that because in the last episode, I accidentally got my brawler to 340 trophies before I could get it um, live for you guys. Um, but I just wanted to secure it on the very first attempt or give myself the best chance possible because now all we need to do is take fourth place, I believe, which we probably had to do it the last time, but um, the same... The same uh, place we would have had to take if we were at 337 but I tried to get it to 339 but I think that's asking for a little bit too much I didn't want to mess with it anymore 
Okay, so we have a bull. Now the problem brawler, to be honest, the main brawler that's been difficult for me is Colt. And Colt is so freaking good against Pam just because Pam is so dang thick. Her um, character is very wide, so it's easy to line up your shots. But these shotgun brawlers have been a cinch, guys, I'm telling you. Nothing but like star shellies and bulls being played on this map like crazy. The occasional Colt, um, but I've been seeing lots, lots, lots of shotgunners. But I'm, feel, I'm feeling very, very comfortable. I feel like Pam... I feel the most comfortable with Pam. The only other brawler that I think was a bit easier was Primo, believe it or not. Um, but Pam has been smooth sailing. She's been a blast. I love this brawler, especially for this challenge. Oh, Primo's going down. We might play it a little bit safe. We're, we're in a good spot. We have three power cubes. We got Frank's teaming up there. But we have three power cubes, and we don't have to really take super high, high positioning. Let's check. The bull's down here somewhere. I don't want to take on those Franks. Ooh, Shelly. Mm, or I mean Jesse, excuse me. We're in a very weird spot here. What do we do? What do we do? Okay, fifth place. We need one more spot. One more spot. Yep, bull. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Come on. Yes. Okay, we got it, guys. Yes. Oh, feels good, man. Get out of there, Franks. What you guys doing, teaming? Let's go. Come on. Oh, my goodness. I'm so pumped up. It was. I think this is the quickest challenge that we've got, guys. Oh, my goodness. It feels good. And we have a Colt on the pro. We'll just see if they can duke it out. But to be honest, I really don't care what we take now <laughs> because we have this brawler secured. Maybe that nine Frank. Will he kind of turn on his buddy? Doesn't look like it. They're pretty in it to the end. Maybe we can take out his his weaker buddy here. I don't think so. Oh, is he going to use the super on us? No. Okay, guys. Third place. I'm fine with that because we're getting 340 trophies and now we can move on to the next brawler. Let's freaking go oh my goodness guys i'm telling you if you've made it to this point in the challenge which i hopefully you have in this video um we're getting to the good part the brawl box opening make sure to try it out for yourself we'd love to be um i'd love to have you a part of the community right now i think we have about four spots left in the band i believe let's take a look yep four spots so this is the main man purple iron man and literally every single person in this band is another member that's trying out the challenge so they only have the road purple iron man brawlers so all level one most of them are shelly's just because shelly is really difficult to get into or to actually get but guys i'm rambling let's get into these brawl boxes so first let's start off with the normal brawl boxes and then we'll get into the megas let's go okay so the brawlers that we're looking for is once again i believe um piper frank mortis leon and spike and guys i will absolutely flip if I get a Legendary Brawler or Mythic, I really want to get that Mortis, guys. I want to get that Mortis under under the belt. Because Mortis is so incredibly fun. I think we can get Mortis even faster than Pam. Mm, I don't know. <laughs> Mortis is going to be all about just staying alive. Oh, I thought that was something. It had a little bit of a delay. Oh my goodness, guys. I'm so psyched. Okay, 12 gems. That's a solid pull out of regular Brawl Boxes. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, anything? Nope. Oh, guys, please. I don't want to get anything because on and i know i called them league rewards in today's video there's so many name changes guys but the next one is going to be dynamite so i guess opening up all this stuff until we get to dynamite is also a possible situation if we get very unlucky with the megas that we open up or these brawl boxes that we could get something out of those like two regular brawl boxes and the big brawl box on the trophy road <laughs> okay let's rip through these here let's see but i want I want to see that spinning, guys. Oh, my goodness. It, there's, like, little delays in the animation sometimes. And it freaks me out. The one thing that I do like about the regular Brawl Boxes and the big Brawl Boxes is you can't necessarily see if you get a Brawler. And it's always the first one. So it's always super, super exciting. Whereas if you have, like, a 6 or higher in the Mega Brawl Boxes, because the normal contents of a Mega Brawl Box is 5. So if you have a 6 in there, you know you have a new Brawler. Imagine if you got like a 7 or an 8. Oh, baby. <laughs> You'll have 2 or 3 brawlers. <laughs> okay, here we go. Come on. 6 more brawl boxes remaining. And then we're getting into the megas. Let's go, let's go. Okay, let's kind of rip through these. We're getting a little bit unlucky. I wonder what my drop rates are. It's been a while. Actually, the, the last one we got was an epic. So, it's been a while since we got a mythic. How about that? Maybe our drop rates for the mythics are a little bit higher. I would not mind getting Mortis. Now, another thing. I haven't come across any of those OP legendary shop offers since the discounted Leon or Spike. So I'm getting a little bit nervous. I feel like that's going to be our best bet when we're transitioning into the legendary brawlers for our next brawlers for the challenge. Um, because our legendary drop rate on this count is 0 .05. So very, very bad. It's going to take so many brawl boxes to get to that. So we might just have to, if we get to that point, we might have to postpone um, the challenge until we get an actual offer. 
Okay, here we go. B uh, big Brawl Box. Nothing. Ooh, never mind. I'm so used to that. I saw the extra one because we are so used to opening up the regular Brawl Boxes. Okay, guys. Moment of truth. It's time to get into the Mega Brawl Boxes. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ooh, we got a free Brawl Box. I just assumed. I just assumed that we um, had, like, tickets or something like that. It's been a while since I had an actual free Brawl Box. Okay, you guys. I was hoping that there would be a Mega Brawl Box on sale, but it doesn't look like it. Okay, here we go. 80 gems. Mm, please, I don't want to go through the League Awards. Give me something. Give me something. Give me, give me, give me. But we have been really lucky on this account, so I can't complain. And the key doublers, as I'm talking about. We got all the bonus items. Okay, here we go. We can do two more Megas. And then we are going to spend 20 bucks on this account, if we need to. <laughs> Hopefully it's in this last one, please. No, oh my goodness, we got all three again. OP and a bunch of gems. Let's go. We're getting a lot of gems from the Megas. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Come on, six. Dang it. Okay, guys, 20 bucks it is. Dirty Gem Array. It's to keep this challenge going, keep the challenge alive, which I will kindly spend towards it, just because it's so much fun for me. Okay, guys, let's bounce back. Let's see. I'm going to save those gems. I could get a, a big bro box. But we have the potential to open up a lot more gems out of the Mega Brawl Boxes that we get for the 20 bucks that we're going to be spending. So here we go. I'm going to get this and see uh, what we get out of them. Here we go. You are all set. That's what I'm talking about. Let's see those gems. Good deal, good deal, good deal. Okay, more Mega Brawl Boxes. Here we go. Come on, you guys. Give me something. Just imagine how difficult it would be to get a Legendary Brawler in this account if we can't even get Epic Brawlers out of the Mega Brawl Boxes that we've opened so far. How many have we opened? Like five? Oh my goodness, what's up with the gems? Let's go. Ah, oh, that's awesome. Okay, I think we're at 62. Rem or never mind, never mind. Come on, give me a six. Give me a six, come on. Okay, getting a lot of power points, which we don't need on this challenge because we can't level up our brawlers whatsoever. Gems? No, tickets. I got to grind out my Robo Rumble tickets um, while it's out right now this weekend. Probably going to do that tomorrow. Let's take a look at our odds really quick. Oops. Okay, so Mythic is 0 0.2496, which is pretty dang good. That's probably pretty average. And then the Epic is 0 0.5. And the Legendary is just out of reach at this point. <laughs> okay, here we go. Come on. Come on. Five again. Oh, I'm getting nervous. I'm getting so nervous. Oh my goodness. How many Brawl Boxes are we going to have to rip through in order to get an Epic? That's all I'm asking for. Brawl Stars, the Supercell Gods, please be nice to me. Please be nice to me. Do it for the video, guys. Do it for the video. We're on the last one. Oh. And you know what? If it does come to Dynamite, I'm okay with that. Just because we do have to get through the League War Brawlers at, at some point. We have them unlocked, technically. But we just haven't received them yet. Comes down to this, guys. Moment of truth. Come on. Oh, dang it. Okay, guys. <laughs> So, League Rewards. We have, like, four Brawl Boxes on League Rewards. Are you kidding me? That was so many Brawl Boxes that we opened. But like I said before, it's always important. We have backups on League Rewards. Or, oh, the, the Trophy Road. Come on, Ray. Get your head on straight. Okay. What is pinging in the shop right now? Just the new offers. Ah, oh, feels bad, man. Feels bad, man. Okay. Coins. Brawl Box. Nothing. Dang it. Gems. Maybe we get enough gems. Power points? I'm putting them suckers on... Oh my goodness, I was going to say. Put them on Mortis, because I'm so used to doing that on my on my uh, mini account. But what do we have the most for? Is that Colt? Let's put them on the most brawler. Bam. Okay, coins. Power points on Colt. Please. Please. Ah, oh, dang it. One brawl box left? It's in the cards for Dynamite. It's what it's looking like right now, guys. Feels bad, man. Okay. Last chance. This is our last chance. Ah, dang it. Okay, time to make it is. Shucks. Okay, eventually we're going to have to get those um, epics, mythics, and legendaries. And guys, if I have to, I'll throw some more money at this count to get some of the mythics or the epics. But I think the legendaries might be a tiny bit out of reach, like I was saying before. But guys, the spinning. Oh my goodness, that will never get old. I'm telling you guys, I love that animation. So freaking OP. And then the final brawler on the list is Bo. And that shouldn't be a too hard, that shouldn't be a too bad brawler either. Just because he has pretty high health amongst the other brawlers. But guys, let's hop into a few matches with my next brawler on the challenge. Dynamite. Oh my goodness, it just looks awesome. Take a look at all the brawlers that we have to two or 340 trophies. Freaking awesome. Okay guys, hopping into it with Dynamite. 
on the same map. He seemed to be pretty dang good in this map, and I should just say, like, Dynamite is actually pretty dang good in this map, is because there's so, so many walls. However, it's littered with shotgunners, so we have to keep that in mind, but we are at lower trophy accounts now, so we're at zero trophies. So they might not be, the brawlers are going to be a little bit more diversified than what we're used to. Let's see if the Colt goes super hyper-aggressive on us. Yep. A little auto-aim action. I'm sure you're shooting at us. Or trying to shoot at us, but his auto-aim went to the box. Star Shelly, let's go. What you got? Ooh, guys, it's going to take a little bit of warming up to get used to this dynamite. Okay. But I do love him. I really like his rework. He looks a lot better, in my opinion. I'm just trying to get my super here. I'm not sure where the Star Shelly is. We have to be careful for her. Is there anyone over here? Mm. One good thing about Dynamite, let's use our super to kind of back her off, use that as somewhat of a stun. One thing about Dynamite is that he's super, super fast at getting the boxes. That's one really important element for the for the brawlers on this challenge. Oh, can we... Oh, we're just out of reach. Looks like, is Pam going to go down? Oh my goodness, everyone's taking a bunch of damage. Shoot the Pam, Rico! Don't use auto-aim, shoot the Pam! She was so low! She's the main focus right now. She she has the most health, the, uh, the most power cubes. Oh, we just missed. Oh my goodness, I need to practice with dynamite, guys. Okay, can we take a first place? We don't have any par cubes to really back that up, but... Come on, Rico. Die! Oh, so close, what is this? We're getting trolled, guys. We're getting trolled this game. I wish that Rico would have killed the Pam. Okay, is that gonna clinch it? Nope. <laughs> These guys are escaping by the... Okay, we actually got Rico there. Okay, good deal. Ooh. Throw in a super. Maybe we can hit both of them. Alright, let's scope this out. Oh my goodness. That mortar's doing some insane damage to us. Where's the other brawler? I only see three on the map. Oh, where is he? Oh my goodness, the, bu the bull chone in the bushes. Typical bull. <laughs> okay, let's hop into the next one. And you know what? I'm a little bit chilled on out, so why don't we try out gem grab or something like that. That's a one nice thing, is you're going to grind the majority of your time on Showdown for this challenge. But once you... Ooh, Shooting Star. Definitely shouldn't play uh, Dynamite on Shooting Star. Alrighty, guys, hopping into it. So, we actually have a pretty solid team. We got Piper and Brock, which are like the aces on this map. And then on their team, they have a Rico, which is okay. I feel like uh, if I'd have to rank them, I'd be like Piper and Brock are like eights here. The best you can be. And then Rico's like, I'd say B. Just because those skill shot brawlers are incredibly important on the long range maps. Okay, let's. I'm, I really want to try to advance on the Piper without. Mm, she keeps hitting us. We're sitting ducks until we get behind a wall. The Piper's landing her shots like crazy. That one would have hit us too. That was super close. Our only chance is to try to avoid. And this Piper knows what she's doing. I'm having a hard time dodging her. Nice, guys. Okay, now we can advance. Now that that Piper isn't breathing down our neck. Let's go. There we go. Oh my goodness. Not enough damage. Not enough damage. Okay, Jesse. Nice. Okay, that's a kill. Good deal. They're nothing without their Piper. Bam! Let's go, guys. Teamwork OP. Okay. Oh my goodness. I need more practice with Dynamite. Mm, that Piper's on us. She's got her eyes on us. Oh, he didn't go back. No, dang it. Okay, 10-8. I was kind of banking that the Jesse would kind of retreat back, but she did the smart thing and just kept going full bore at us while we were throwing the super there. Okay, we're just going to play this cheese old dynamite strategy. She'll behind the wall. No, Piper, you supered the wrong, wrong way, man. Oh, so close. This damage. I need more damage. Okay. Ooh, one super, and that's going to kill that Rico. I think our super does 2,000 damage. Okay, 14, 13. We're in the lead by one. So get back, Brock. Okay, we have to be careful for the Piper. Maybe we can bait out some shots here. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Ooh, they're making me sweat. I'll take that. That is juicy, juicy bounty points from that Piper. Don't know why she jumped in, but you know what? I'll take that. <laughs> okay. 
Let's see, let's see. If you guys didn't know, a little secret about me, or I shouldn't say a secret, I say it all the time. Oh, we, we have to be careful. We have to be careful. Get close, get close, get close. Oh, ho, 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 ho. wow. What the heck? Our teammates died at the very end, like, <laughs> simultaneously. Ooh, that Rico is pretty high up there. 263 trophies. Um, but Bounty is one of my favorite game modes. Super, super fun for me to play on. Don't know why. I've always just liked the simplicity of it. Okay, let's jump into another one with it. And then with, if we have time, I know this episode is probably pretty dang long as is. Just because we opened up a bunch of Brawl Boxes without getting a Brawler. So that eats up a lot of time. Um, so this might be the last one here. Okay, let's see. Okay, we're going up against a Dynamite. And I m would much rather have a Dynamite on Bounty than a Barley. Because Barley's more of control. Uh, come on. Come on. Get me out of here. Oh, baby. Oh, I was trying my best. Serpentine. The concentration was on point. Doing my absolute best. He just kept pausing. I was kind of expecting him to kind of spam, you know? Okay. Nice. Piper, get him, get him. Okay, Dynamite got a super. He was able to pick up a kill. Kidding me? Okay, these balls are kind of tanky. Tankier than uh, some of the weaker ones, like a Piper or something like that. And we only do 760 damage each one stick of dynamite. Okay, let's get up here. Barley, you gotta go, my man. Get out of there. Okay, we're posting up up here. We're being aggressive here. Ah! Guys, I suck with dynamite. I need practice. Practice, please. This is gonna be good, though. That's one good thing about the blue Iron Man. You get a lot of practice with the brawler that you're playing with. <laughs> At least a good three-hour grind stash with the brawler. Which you can learn a lot in three hours, that's for sure. Okay, Colt, main target. 7 to 13. Come on, you guys. One thing that I, need, that I can't stress enough is try not... Ooh. Wow, good super on the barley's part. I was just talking mad trash against that barley. Okay, can we make a comeback here? We're going to have to try to advance. Okay. Full concentration. Let's go. Come on, guys. Okay. Got the Colt. Nice. Come on, Rico. Colt, I don't want to go for you, man. I want to go for your OP high bounty teammates. There's Tara. Oh, Tara just has too much health. Oh, guys, I tried, but we are way... Eh, we could have. We could have got... If we got the Barley and the Tara, we could have tied it, I believe. Or one, one more. Ooh, those guys are good. What is that? The matchmaking is weird, man. Very, very weird. Okay, you guys, so I think I'm going to end it on that note. Thank you guys for tuning in to another video. Like I said before, I really, really appreciate the support that you guys bring to this series because it's one of my pride and joys here on YouTube. It's one of my favorite things to come back to every single week, like I said in the beginning of the video. So guys, take it easy. And with that being said, make sure to keep having fun with Brawl Stars and we'll see you in the next video. And guys, Dynamite is jumping around like crazy, saying goodbye as well. <laughs> Peace out.